guys. Thanks for joining in another vlog. Sorry there hasn't been much content this year. COVID-19 has been pretty difficult, but in Victoria and Australia, things are starting to look good. So there's rallies coming up on the calendar and Victoria is allowed to run a rally end of November. But it's been a busy year with me having a baby as well. Uh, so that's been an interesting experience, but also a fun one. But Datsilla hasn't been prepared well enough for the rally. So don't have a car ready. The True Line Commercial VK Commodore though is available. That car was going to a Targo rally earlier in the year. It literally got stopped when it was packed into the container, ready to go on the boat. So my fortune was that that car stayed in Australia and I'm gonna do Yarra Valley stages in it. commercial VK Commodore come to my place before it was going to Otago to do some testing. Uh, unlucky but lucky for me it broke a rocker uh, so Craig changed them, improved the engine a little bit, done some tuning with a Motec and it's 20 kilowatts up on the last time I drove it so that really should make the power delivery really good through the corners and also you don't have to change gears many times with the Hollinger gearbox in that car anyway because it's got so much torque. So the car's set to go I just need to get my driving skills up with not having driven much this year. Victoria having its borders locked down, we had to find a co-driver within the state. That was interesting for me because you usually have Rhiannon living in America now, she couldn't come over. And Ben's done this rally the last two years in a row with me when we won two-wheel drive outright. So he's over in WA. So we had a look around and Kate Catford was available. Kate had never sat with me before, but co-driven for plenty of experienced drivers and won Targa Championship last year outright. So. It was a no-brainer really, so Kate's first time in the car, no testing or anything, so Mount Slide was going to be our first test. Recce and preparation went really well though, so that's always a good sign going into the rally. First stage Mount Slide, always an epic stage. Looking back at footage from my dad when he used to rally, did some Australian Championship rounds. It's so iconic, only six k's long, but also a really good warm up. The VK had a bit more power this year as well, so we we're sliding around some of the corners and having a bit of fun, but we hit trouble three k's in, the car started to overheat. We pushed through to the end, uh, but then we had to pull out. Uh, we went back to service and what had happened was two thermo fans had been fitted behind the radiator and the wiring had, had actually melted. So we pulled that out, put the old standard fan back on, we're able to rejoin after service. The afternoon loop was a repeat of the morning five stages, but one stage had to be cancelled because of the rain. We hadn't seen that in the morning, so we were hoping that it was going to start to dry out because all the competitors were complaining about how slippery it had been. Plus right camber, then the seven right short don't, into eight left hook, into eight right short 40, seven left into nine right short, then seven left hook, up 100, braking crest, immediate four right, medium, then seven left down, 50, 
yeah, yeah. Six left narrows into eight right short. 80. Ten left short. Caution. Breaking 50. Six left short. Into slow four right switch. Six left in. Into seven right wide. It opens long. We had the 22k stage. This was a big improvement on last year. The local shire made some grading and big improvements throughout the road. And we really enjoyed it, you know, pushed through pretty hard and had a good run. Then four minus left into flat five right. Then eight left over brow, breaking Titans four plus. Titans four plus. Then keep eight left flat, surface 200. Right hook. Then nine right into eight left. Into break early, eight right, fifty, turn square left down, don't. It's eight right here, fifty, turn square left down, don't. Two fifty. three stages uh, we just really pushed on there's some downhill uphill and the stages really change a lot they're not like a consistent stage for the whole period um, it's narrow then wide then up and down and the slipperiness really made it difficult we went out on the km4 tire it's a medium with an open tread and it was quite slippery with how cool it was it's only around average 17 degrees um, but also pretty slippery um, but, you know, we pushed on, we did the 70 odd kilometres. It was just so good to get back out and do a rally again when they've been most of the year just working away or in lockdown and having to wear a face mask. And, you know, it's been so difficult for everyone. It's really cool to get back what I love doing. Repeat, it's 200. Eight left, medium, fast. Into 10 right, short. Then. Flat 10 left short, 120. Turn five left, small hook, main road. This is turn five left, small hook, main road. Then 10 right over small brow, 150. 10 right, 250. 10 right short, then 10 left on brow. Caution, breaking 100, loose, seven minus left short. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Make sure you subscribe here. It's cool to see more people joining all the time. Next year, we'll be aiming to bring you heaps more content again. Hopefully it settles down around the world with COVID. And we can get back out and compete what we love doing. Datzilla is getting a refresh, so we'll keep you updated on what's happening there. And we'll be hoping to do some Victorian and Australian rallies in that next year. And also... The 100th anniversary of Alpine is at the end of the year. So that's a big ticket. Prepare the car over the year. 
and go at that one and have a fast, reliable car. Cheers.